We're about to begin in a couple of minutes. Please find a quiet place in your home. Finding a quiet corner where you can sit comfortably. We'll be chanting Om in three audible parts. We will be loud. We will be quiet. Find a place where you're able to chant without being interrupted, without being worried about who might hear you. Finding a quiet place, find a clean, comfortable spot to sit. It doesn't matter if you're sitting on the floor or a chair, or a bed, or a couch. It does not matter if you're sitting cross-legged or just in any other posture. All that matters is that you're comfortable with your back straight, back, neck, and head in a straight line. So find your spot. <clears throat> and sit down comfortably. We're going to begin in another minute or so. You can let me know if the audio is, is loud enough for you. <clears throat> now prepare to sit comfortably, <clears throat> sitting in any comfortable posture, sitting with the back straight, back, neck and head in a straight line. Close your eyes gently, relax the expression on the face. Let the tongue become heavy and fall into the mouth. Relax your shoulders. Relax your belly. Now bring your attention to your belly. As you breathe in, let the belly expand. As you breathe out, let the belly return back to its original shape. <clears throat> breathing into the belly. Breathing out from the belly. Slow your breath down and be comfortable. Breathing into the belly, let the belly expand. As you breathe out, gently let go. Breathing out, just let go. Letting go of all your thoughts. Letting go of every unfinished business. Letting go of everything outside this room and this time we have together. As you breathe out, feel a sigh of relief sweeping through the body as you let go of everything. Just let go. Breathing into the belly, let the belly expand. As you exhale, feel like a feather falling slowly and gently to the earth below, free to fly without any weight, just light.
We're going to begin in a few breaths. Pay attention to your breath and pay attention to what this question means to you in this moment. The question is, how does my breath feel? What is the quality of my breath? Pay attention to what the question might mean and how you might find its answer. Beyond all words, beyond all descriptions, and yet the most subjective of experiences. You can know how your breath feels, even without having words for it. This feeling may not be stable right now. We will go deeper into it. Today's sitting, we're reaching for a place of quiet, active relaxation. We will be actively engaged and paying attention to everything and yet everything will be relaxed. First with the body, then with the breath, then with the mind. Reaching for a place of infinite space, infinite lightness, infinite warmth and luminosity. Using our quality experience as a guide. Now we're going to begin. Bring your palms together at the heart center. Press your palms together gently. Press your fingers together gently. Gently touch the back of the thumbs into the chest. <clears throat> now bring your attention to the hollow space between the palms. Keep your attention right here as you inhale and exhale, paying attention attention to the vibration, attention to the electricity, attention to the sound when we chant. We'll be chanting Om three times and then the opening pairs Sahana Bhavadu. Exhale completely and take a deep breath. Inhale. Om. with your left hand and breathing in, stretch. As you breathe out, bend forward in a deep sense of surrender. Come back up, breathing in, release your hands, rub your palms to generate some heat and gently shield your eyes, don't touch your eyes, just shield your eyes with your palms and then blinking, open your eyes and pull your palms back like an open book. Namaskar. 
<clears throat> Namaskar. My name is Gaurav Rastogi. My spiritual name is Ekras Gorak. I'll be uh, leading you through the meditation sitting. There's no need to open your eyes. Sit comfortably. I'll be giving you guided instructions. I'll be repeating every instruction a few times. So there's no need to feel nervous. Try to be playful. Try to be firm with yourself. The mind will play, play tricks. Good thoughts, bad thoughts, big thoughts, small thoughts, quick thoughts, slow thoughts, all manner of thoughts will come and go. They're none of our business. Don't worry about the thoughts. We will not invite the thoughts. We will not engage the thoughts. We will not propel the thoughts. We will not repel the thoughts. We're simply not going to pay any attention to the thoughts. Thoughts feed on attention. It gives them the energy to move about. And when you don't feed your thoughts with attention, they die. And so pay no attention to good or bad thoughts. They're none of our concerns. Simply look for my instructions and follow along. Here's what's about to happen. We're going to first bring our attention to the body. This is an hour long sitting. We will slowly and gradually stabilize the body because we have the time. Then we will bring our attention to the breath, extending and stabilizing the breath, finding the breath that's the most pleasing. Then we will bring our attention to the mind itself. Through the chanting of Om, we will make the mind clear, expansive, warm and luminous. And then we will revel, rejoice in this infinite expanse of mind space. All this in 50 minutes. So get ready. Sitting comfortably in any posture, sit with your back straight, back, neck and head in a straight line. Close your eyes gently and relax the expression on the face. We'll come back here. Relax your shoulders, relax your belly. The weight of the body is now pressing into the floor through the hips and the thighs. Your posture is going to be unmoved, stable, a source of strength for you and your sitting. Stiram Sukhamasanam. Sit in a comfortable, stable posture. Now stability is important, but your legs are going to go off to sleep. So make sure you have cushions under your knees if you need to. And is fortify your mind. Your legs are going to go off to sleep. Your neck is going to hurt. Your back is going to give way. Don't worry about it. None of this is permanent. So if your legs go to sleep, let them go to sleep. In my years of teaching meditation, no one has walked away with legs breaking off. So it's all right to let your legs sleep. They'll wake back up when you do. Now, take your attention all the way to the top of the head where the hair seems to cyclone out. Stay right here. Now we're going to move in a spiral manner very, very slowly. We're going to go to the front, left, back, right, and then inch after inch, slowly spiraling out and down. What we're doing is moving the attention and just like noisy children, paying attention to whatever part of the body calls itself to you. And what we're doing is simply acknowledging and moving on. So you'll feel a pain. You look at, when, you're, when you look at that part which is hurting you, acknowledge the pain and move on. 
choose not to respond to it. Beginning at the top of the head, let's begin radiate, cycling out, spiraling out, front, left, back, right. Slowly moving, scanning the body and anything, itch, scratch, pain, ache, tickle, electricity, buzzing, whatever happens, just pay attention to it and move on. I'll ring the bell to remind you to keep moving slowly. There's no need to rush. Everything will get its attention. Nothing will get your response. Bringing the attention all the way down to the contact between the body and the seat. Through the hips and the thighs, the weight is equally distributed. The entire weight of your body is pressing into the floor below. We're going to adjust the posture, keeping the back straight and then just tilting forward, left, right. We're going to find the center. Keep your attention at the contact between the body and the floor below, hips and thighs. Now, keeping the back straight, lean forward just a little. Observe. Observe how the weight shifts from the hips to the thighs. Come back to the center. We're trying to locate the center. Now, lean back just a little, observing how the weight shifts away from the thighs to the hips, come back to the center. The weight subtly shifts. Lean to the left and observe how the weight shifts to the left. Come back to the center and lean to the right, observing that the weight shifted to the right. Come back to the center. Finding the center where the weight is equally distributed between the left and the right, between the right, hips and the thighs. The weight is equally distributed. The floor is holding us and preventing us from falling. And in knowing that we are not going to fall down, we can let all parts of the body relax other than the lower back. Bring your attention to your toes and relax your toes. Relax the soles of your feet. Relax your ankles. Relax the top of the feet. Relax your calves, relax your knees, relax your thighs, relax your hips, relax your pelvic area. Relax the entire lower part of the body. Relax the entire lower part of the body. The lower part of the body is completely relaxed. Bring your attention below the belly button. Two fingers below and one finger inside the body. We're going to chant in loud ah sound with the mouth open wide and the Adam's apple open wide. You're going to make the sound as if coming out from the center below your belly button. Akara three times. Pay attention to the center and use your intuition to find the center and stay right there as you inhale and exhale. Then you pay attention to the sound. You'll pay attention to the vibration you pay attention to the energy of vibration as it radiates out. And then in the third chant, 
Pay attention to the space that opens up when you chant Akara loudly. <clears throat> There's a lot to do. There's no time to be distracted. Exhale completely. Take a deep breath. Inhale. Ah. Inhale, keep your attention. Ah. Inhale, pay attention to the space. Silence. Silence. Pay attention to the space. Bring your attention to the base of the spine. We're going to travel up the spine, one vertebra at a time. Opening up the spinal column, sitting upright and straight. <clears throat> Slowly, attention traveling up from one vertebra to the next. Relax your belly, let the belly fall down under the effect of gravity and moving freely with the breath. Relax your chest. Pull your shoulders back and let go. Relax your shoulders. Relax your shoulders. Relax your upper arms. Relax your elbows. Relax your forearms. Relax your wrists. Relax the back of the hands. Relax the fingers. Relax the palms of the hands. Relax the entire middle part of the body. Relax the entire middle part of the body. The middle part of the body is completely relaxed. Bring your attention to the center of the chest in the middle, right at the base of the ribcage, above your belly. A space in and out of your skin. We're looking for the center of the oo sound by chanting it three times. A space will open up filled with energy, filled with vibration, filled with sound and resonance, filled with peace. Loud Ukara three times. Exhale completely. Take a deep breath. Inhale. Oh. Inhale. Oh.
stay in this space. Resonating, vibrating, peace filled space opens up and stays open. The lower part of the body is relaxed, the middle part of the body is relaxed. Bring your attention to the neck. We're going to adjust the head, finding a place for the neck to relax. As you exhale, bring the chin into the chest. As you inhale, take the nose to the ceiling. Come back to the center. Tilt your head to the left. Tilt your head to the right. Come back to the center. Turn your head to the left. Turn your head to the right. Come back to the center. Now point your nose a little above the horizon line, allowing the head to rest gently on the neck, allowing the neck muscles to relax. Bring a gentle smile to your face. Relax your chin. Relax your lower jaw. Relax. Relax your lower jaw. Let the tongue become heavy and fall into the mouth. Relax your tongue. Relax your lips. Relax your upper jaw. Relax your cheeks. Relax your nose. Relax your ears. Relax the back of the head. Relax the crown of the head. Relax the forehead. Now letting the eyes sink into their sockets. Relax the eyes. Relax the entire upper part of the body. Relax the entire upper part of the body. The upper part of the body is completely relaxed. Eyes still closed. Bring your attention above the eyes in the middle of the skull inside the forehead. One to two fingers inside. Try to roll your eyes with the eyelids still closed, looking at a spot above your eyelids. We're going to chant the mmm sound, makara, three times, loud enough to penetrate our skull and form a halo around the top part of the body. Makara, three times, thousand points of, of intersection. They'll be poking out like, um, like a pinball. So it would like, like, a, like a pinhead. We'll be having the sound coming from thousands of points of, around the skull. So push the sound out with this, with your energy. Makara, three times. Exhale completely. Take a deep breath. Inhale. Mm. Silence. 
all three centers radiating out calmness, energy, peace. and a sense of indescribable quiet. Now, ask yourself this question again. How does our mind breath feel? What is the quality? of my breathing experience. Is my breath shallow? Is my breath quick? Does my breath turn too quickly? Is my breath bringing me a sense of energy and infinite possibilities? Is my breath Deep is my breath flowing evenly. Slow down your breath a couple of notches. Now using your experience as a guide, slow down your breath to the most pleasing sensation, where the moment to moment experience of the breath is unhurried, joyous. and filled with energy. What is the quality of my moment to moment experience of being alive. How does it feel to be alive? Find the pace of breathing which is slow, highly even, unhurried and above all the most pleasant.
we are going to pinch and extend the breath. Just remember, we are not going to speed up the breath. We are keeping the same pace of breath, simply pinching and extending the ends of the breath, pulling it, making it longer. Every moment, a source of joy and energy, infinite possibilities in every breath. Bring your attention to the belly. Pay attention to the gentle movement of the belly with the breath. As you inhale, observe the belly expand. As you exhale, let the belly return back. Inhaling, the belly is expanding. Exhaling, the belly is returning back. Now bring your attention just to one moment. At the end of the inhale, when the belly has expanded, at the end of the that the belly expands and begins to return back. Now bring your attention to the other moment. At the end of the exhale, when the belly has shrunk, and now you're beginning to inhale, and the belly expands. We're going to pull this end of the breath and extend it. As you ex exhale, watch the belly return back to its original shape. At the end of the exhale, pull the belly in, exhale a little bit of breath. Pull the belly in a little bit more, exhale a little bit more breath, slowly. And then the belly is pulled in, simply let go. And then the breath normally and naturally rushes into the belly first. Without rushing, breathe into the belly, breathe into the chest. Now at the end of the inhale, pull the shoulders back a little, just half an inch. And begin to exhale. No need to rush the breath. At the end of the exhale, pull the belly in, 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 in. Then gently let go and begin to inhale. Long inhale into the belly, into the chest, into the shoulders. And then begin the exhale naturally and slowly. At the end of the exhale, pull the belly in, expel, expel, expel. Then let go and let the belly expand out. A gentle, longer rhythm of your breath. You've pinched and extended the breath. Now, there's no need to breathe so much. So slow down the breath. Easily, comfortably. Find the slowest pace of breath that you can maintain evenly and that you can maintain without feeling this sense of anxiety that you need to rush your breath. Find the slowest, most pleasing pace of breath, pinching and extending with the belly and the shoulders. Slowly maintaining an even pace of inhale and exhale. Savor 
every moment. Enjoy every moment of your breath. Use your experience as a guide, finding the slowest, most pleasing, most even pace of breath. Pay attention to your breath, maintaining the rhythm. Now ask yourself this question again. What is the quality of my breath? How does my breath feel moment to moment to moment? Finding a breath infinitely, keeping you in a state of energy, complete potential, quietness, a sense of peace and possibility in every moment, infinitely. Keep this rhythm of your breath. Keep asking yourself and finding the most optimal pace, calmness, peace and possibilities in an infinite loop. Now let go. Change your breathing pattern to a normal, calm breathing pattern. Not the extended breath, but just what happens, happens on its own. A peace pervades the entire body, pervades and extends past our skin. A peace that reflects out from the world, heart into the world outside. And this sense of peace and possibilities is the ocean which we find ourselves in, completely submerged, unable to tell the difference between outside and inside, inside and outside. Thoughts will come, thoughts will go. Be playful and firm. Keep 
watching the experience. Now we'll expand the space with sound. Those three centers below the belly button, in the center of the chest, and above the eyes in the middle of the forehead. Three centers of A, ah, U, and M, mm, and a fourth center of silence. We're going to chant O oh, in three audible parts in a continuous single sound, but that continues from A ah to U uh, to M mm, to silence. There are two types of silence I'd like you to pay attention to. One, at the end of the A, uh, U uh, and M mm sound, keep an equal amount of breath for that silence, which seems to radiate out from outside the skull. But don't worry about this part. The second silence is in the center of all these three sounds and extending into the fourth silent space. There is a silence you will find filled with energy and possibilities in the center of the sound. That's what you're looking for. We're going to chant Om in a continuity in three audible parts. I'm going to ring the bell to coordinate our breathing. Try to keep pace. And if you can't be, keep pace, just wait quietly. When I ring the bell, begin your inhale and we'll be coordinated again. The inhale is quick. The exhale is slow. We're paying attention to three sounds and two types of silences. Are you ready? Exhale completely. Take a deep breath. Inhale. Uh. instructions. In this silence, investigate very carefully these three centers. Look for vibrations, resonance, energy, electricity, some sort of space, a feeling of spaciousness. Investigate everything as if you don't believe what you hear from me. Find out for yourself and use your experience, your intuition as a guide. Find that space. We're going to chant loudly again. This time, more evenly going through a ah, oo mm, making almost an, a single om sound but paying attention to all three of these centers and the two silences one at the end and one all through and that final silence stays with us as we inhale and as we exhale that's the silence which we're looking for even right now 
We're about to begin. Exhale completely. Take a deep breath. Inhale. Uh. But with surprise, as this silence filled with energy, filled with vibration, filled with peace and possibilities, now extends into your fingers, your hands, your palms, your arms, your legs, your feet, your toes, the entirety of your body, the top of your hair, every inch of your skin, every inch cubic inch of space that fills your skin. Continue to watch with surprise as this sensation now pervades the entirety of your known universe. All is filled with this sound. All is filled with this sound. Everything. Is this sound. Everything arises from this sound. Everything arises and ends in the sound. We're going to chant Om again. Stay with the sound. Locate the center of your own existence. We're going to begin again. Exhale completely. Take a deep breath. Inhale. Uh,
Stay in the silence. Stay in the silence. Bring your palms together at the heart center, pressing the palms together gently, pressing the fingers together gently, gently touching the back of the thumbs into the chest. We'll chant all three times and then the closing prayers, Sarve Bhavantu Sukhina. Exhale completely, take a deep breath, inhale. Sarve Bhavantu Sukhinaha 
सर्वे सन्तु निरामया सर्वे भद्रा पश्य कचि दुख भवे ओ शांति 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 Take your arms behind you. Grab your right wrist with your left hand and breathing in, stretch. Breathing out, bend forward in a deep sense of surrender. Come back up, breathing in. <coughs> Rub your palms together to generate some heat and gently shield your right paws. Don't cover, touch them, and then blinking, open your eyes and pull your palms back, back and open book. Namaskar. Thank you. If you have any questions or comments, uh, this is a good time to ask them. Otherwise, thank you very much. Have a great weekend. Namaste, Guruji. Thank you. Thank you. Namaste. Namaste. Thank you. Namaste. Have a good evening. Thank you, Guruji. Thank you. Thank you, Guruji. Have a good evening. Thank you. Good night. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, good job, Guru. Thank you, Sanjay. Thank, Thank you.